Eagle, please stand for your pledge to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Now pause for your moment of silence. And now on to the rest of your morning announcements. Hey Key Club, we had a meeting last night, so if you didn't make it, make sure you go and grab a calendar from either Ms. Manchesky's room or Ms. LaDuke's room. Also, if you're a UNICEF um, team leader, you, we have a meeting before school Monday if you weren't at the one last night. And also, if you didn't get your shirts last night, they'll be passed out Monday during all, four, or all three lunches, so come get them. Thanks. All right, cross country. Uh, we went to uh, Sharp Springs yesterday and we used yes, our force. Um, the guys got runner-up um, and the girls got first. As far as individuals, the, uh, Nicole won the whole thing. Yeah, Nicole won uh, again. Um, as far as uh, girls, I think we had all seven in the top 15 and then we had four guys in the top 20. Oh, and Tyler Boone set a new school record of 16-14. So. There you go. That's it. Okay, hey Seagull, save and still collect the money up until next Wednesday, I believe. So if you see anybody in the hallway with a little bin or a jar, donate. It's for a great cause. And we cannot, we cannot let Oakland beat us, so donate to Seagull. Come on, y'all got this. Also, Seagull Archery is having a zombie shoot next Saturday um, at Smyrna Middle School. So, be there. I'll be out. All right, soccer. Yay. Woo. Hey guys, soccer won the um, region um, <laughs> championship, <laughs> and we play Saturday against Warren County at six o'clock at the high school. Um, this is an elimination game to get to state or not, so everybody come out and support us. Hey. Hey. <laughs> All right, football. We have a huge game tonight against Smyrna at seven. Um, this is to determine whether we have a. Um, undefeated season, so let's go out and have a big win. Everybody come out and support. We're tailgating. tailgating. We're tailgating there at 5 o'clock. We'll be here at the school around that time to give rides. It's a short drive. Also, big news, taco bar. Taco bar at tailgate, so be there. <laughs> Good morning, Seagull. Hey, Mitchell, did you know you can reduce the risk of getting cancer? Yes, you can. You have to exercise, you have to eat healthy, you have to get regular checkups, don't smoke, don't drink, and always use sunscreen. That's a great way to do it. It's things that we can do at any age. Reduce your risk. Hey, don't forget, come out and support Seagull High School Fall Marketplace this Saturday, 9 to 4. So before you go to that soccer game and cheer on the girls, come out, do some Christmas shopping, donate blood, and also sign up for the bone marrow registry. Help save a life. Thanks. Also, t-shirts are still on sale. All right, good morning, Seagull. Uh, we only have a couple days left in our canned food drive, so uh, we have some posters here to help you understand what you have to do if you want to have a pep rally next Friday for the first round of the playoffs. We have to reach a total of 25,000 items. Uh, that means that as of our last uh, collection, everyone would have to bring in five more items or $1.25 more per student in the school. So you're going to have to get out there, start collecting, clean out your uh, cabinets this weekend if you want to have that pep rally next Friday. Okay. <laughs> if you want to see a pie in the face, uh, Mr. Bridgman, I don't know if he really volunteered, but uh, you know, I'm sure he'll get out there. Uh, Mr. Andres, we'll get you a hairnet so Hold you don't on, mess wait, up your wait hair. Wait a second. I just got something that just brought to my attention. I got a petition signed by all my freshman class, and it says they this, Miss Walker. Their names? Well, yes, they can. Oh. <laughs> they really about the pine of face, they're so worried about you know messing up my hair. Family pictures coming up. Got a oh, really, yeah. and so they have a petition that says that. Uh, please allow Coach Matlock to take the pie in the face for Mr. Andres if you guys can reach 30,000 cans. So my freshman, I really appreciate it. But Coach Matlock, I, man, stepping up for me, 
Professionalism I, I, rubric I, I right really there. appreciate that. So anyways, 30,000. Yes. At that pep rally next Friday, if you hit 30,000, we're going to have pies flying um, at some select administrators. Uh, Mr. Matlock, evidently some teachers are stepping up. That's so that's going on. <laughs> Somebody has to make the pies. I can't get one in the face. All right. And then also, if you want a school dance what? with a DJ, 35,000 items. A lot of people have been asking, begging, can we please have a dance at Siegel High School? So here's how you can earn that dance. 35,000 items, that means that everyone in the school would have to bring in 10 more items or $2.50 uh, more on addition to what we already have. So keep that in mind, pick your goal, and uh, we only have till Halloween, which is next Wednesday, so just a few more days to get those collections done. <laughs> All right, anyways, good morning the most powerful high school in the nation. Uh, Mr. Bridgman is um, trying to get people to sign up, get the pie in the face, but Coach Matlock stepped up for me. I appreciate that. All right, in the news today, you already heard from our girls' soccer team. Lady Stars shut out Blackman to win the title Saturday night. Um, big show down here at the uh, high school. Also, cross country, you saw them, Nicole Gardner, Tyler Boone, Trish Frazier right here in a second. So anyways, we've got some great runners. Uh, congratulations to Coach Young and what he's done here at Siegel High School. Um, big ball game tonight. I hope everybody has a wonderful weekend, and don't forget to use your force. Glencliff High School is hosting a workshop on college essay writing on Tuesday, November 6th. Register at southernword.org. If you are interested, or see Ms. Harrell for a paper application. Now on to you, Samantha. Thanks, Clark. Any DECA member wanting to attend the National Predators Leadership Night on November 27th needs to turn in $45 no later than November 2nd to Ms. Brown. This includes transportation, a meal voucher, t-shirt, and a ticket to the game. Girls basketball tryouts are Monday, October 29th from 5 to 6 p.m. And now on to you, Trisha. Thanks, Samantha. The Siegel High School Fall Marketplace in Blood Drive is this Saturday from 9 to 4 p.m. Give the gift of life and donate blood or sign up for the Bone Mayor Registry in room 725. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Brown or Ms. Anderson. That's all for your announcements, Siegel. Have a... Let's, Let's get, get Weird, weird Friday. Friday.